Going on swing traders today, I'm gonna do MARA. This stock jumped up about almost 9% today, so it's doing pretty good. Just like to remind you to subscribe to my channel, hit the bell so you get the notification on these swing trades and like this video. And uh, let's get right into the swing trade here, huh? So this stock just recently went through a reverse split and this happened back on April 8th. So three days ago, if you include today. And what they did was a four to one reverse stock. So when they did this, this stock was 62 cents and it basically shot them up to about 230. So this is a company that basically mines cryptocurrency for the blockchain. They have a 26,000 square foot data center. And as of right now, they're currently mining Bitcoin, but their systems can also be configured to mine other cryptocurrencies in the near future. And if you ever wondered how they mine Bitcoin, here's a look at it right here. And it basically takes a lot of electricity and a lot of fans to cool down all these CPUs. So if any of you people thought that mining Bitcoin was cheap, you're completely wrong. So if you're thinking about getting into a cryptocurrency stock that deals with Bitcoin, you definitely want to look at Bitcoin's chart before you get into it. And as you can see right here, if I zoom in, Bitcoin just dumped right now pretty good. But the RSI is at a really good spot right now. It's right in the middle. So this is something that I want to look at before I get into the swing trade tomorrow morning. Because whatever Bitcoin is doing, it's going to affect this stock. All right, I got the chart pulled up here on this stock. I got a 10-day, 30-minute chart here. And this is when the RS happened right here, you can see. And today, this stock absolutely killed it. And what I'm looking here is to see if this stock can hold the support here at $3.37. Don't want to see it getting down to the 285 mark because if this thing gets under 285 it's not going to be looking good but as you can see here this stock had tons of volume in the afternoon and i got a feeling it's going to pour over into tomorrow but if you get in this one you want to make sure you have some day trades left just in case you want to get out of it all right i have the 10 year two day chart here pulled up i just want to show you this so i can show you the resistance Let's zoom in real quick so if this thing is going to move up, we got some resistance at 428. And then we got some other resistance here at 434. Yeah, thanks guys for watching. I really appreciate it. But first thing in the morning, I definitely want to look at Bitcoin to see what it's doing, to see if it's dropping or it's going up. Because if Bitcoin starts going up, this stock could just run right out of the gates. But if Bitcoin's dropping, I want to see if it hits the support around 337 or so. So just like to remind you to subscribe to my channel. Like this video if you guys enjoyed it. And let's make some money, everybody. Yeah.